Hey there, Ulti Zeta here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Metroid Prime Hunters. In the last episode, we did, uh, we did Alinos, and we explored a little bit of Vesper Defense Outpost. Couldn't get too far, but we did get a green weapon. So, in this episode, we're gonna go to Arcterra. And see what this place has in store for us. Arcterra. Okay. With a voice of thunder shall the green wood burst into an orange blaze. Okay. Thank you. Let's see what we got to explore in here, shall we? I mean, I could probably just hop all the way down, but since there's probably also going to be an escape route eventually, it's good to kind of be aware of, like, what I'll be going backwards through, you know? Something screeched at me. Oh, there's actual ice physics. Look at me sliding. Okay. So this is an actual ice world. Oh, that's Trace! I don't know who the blue guy is, but the red guy is Trace! And Samus is kind of here. Get out of top mode. doesn't do that much to him. Okay, so I had a full energy tank, but him standing up underneath me murdered me? So, good to know. Excuse me. I thought I was being clever by kind of, like, standing up un above his thing and, like... Let me break out. See, it's, it's not hard when you're, like, not trying to cheese it, but I was, like, being, like, kind of cheesy and then he just s stood on me.
Okay, so what weirded me out there was like... What's attacking me? I thought I destroyed this! Didn't I destroy it? Whatever. Okay, so if I can find an E-Tank anywhere, that would be appreciated. But yeah, what was weird about that was like... When I died, it like... It, it like... It was like, oh, the hunter took an Octo thing, whatever. Which was like, okay, I, I got that, but I figured that was just like a, oh, game over sort of situation. But then I respawned, and like, time reset, but then he still had the Octa thing? And I recovered it? Which is just... It's just kind of weird, is what my, my mindset was. Okay, so there's a bunch of locks to disengage, apparently. You know, when I thought that this game was going to have a bunch of random hunters and whatnot, I figured it was going to be kind of like Mega Man-esque, where like, you fight somebody and get their ability. Or kind of like Metroid Prime 3, I guess, is also a good example of such a thing happening. Over here, yeah. No. Well, the last lock is in here. Zoop. Now, where the hell is that? Recognize it as a place of my being. Help me. Seriously, where where the hell was that? Ah! 
Found it. Can't hide from me forever. All right, so that unlocks all the doors now. Okay. I don't have purple. And this is still locked, interesting. Artifact. That's how I entered. Oh, the artifact was what was blocking this door. Okay. So am I gonna have to fight Trace soon? He's like one of the only. Oh, okay. I found a thing that electrocutes a thing. Cool. partially been restored to the circuit. Um, okay. The bugs didn't like me not... not fighting them earlier. Not too bad, once I'm, like, not using the... Because I they were green, so I was like, oh, I'm going to use my green weapon on them, and it wasn't really doing much. Okay. I still can't get that, because I don't have that. Surprise me every time.
I don't seem to be able to use that wind to get up there. There's all this stuff up here, but I, I don't see a way to get to it. I guess I'll just go this way? Ah. You gotta come in through the other direction on that one. Okay. These icy enemies are obnoxious. I'm gonna say that much. Don't like the enemies that can freeze you. me a purple orb. How does one get purple orb? The Judicator! It's fire super cool plasma. That's what I've been looking for. This thing looks like it's scanning things, and I'm gonna... Oh, okay. Never mind. Morph ball in through here. Gotcha. I'm having problems. No. Nope. Okay. Why does that part of this song... Ah! Never mind, that was an actual timer. Okay. Good to know. Come on! Oh my god. The controls of the fucking Morph Ball are really annoying to use. Oh. Alright. Can I restart the platform thing? No. Okay, this is getting a little obnoxious. Not gonna NGL. Why is this the hardest thing in the world? Alright, now I know you have to get on a platform that moves.
Okay, I didn't know what was going on there. Ooh, okay, there's a <laughs> there's a lip. There's a lip. We're all good. There's a lip. We found the judicator. I like that icon. It's a cool icon. Okay. What? Oh, I'm not on Judicator. Okay, well, I found the portal. I'm back over here. First things first. Gimme. Your universal ammo capacity is increased by 30 units. Oh. Wait, hang on. I fire one. Nice. Oh, so they all work together. Okay. So it's green just because it can be, not because it's specifically for that thing. Gotcha. That's just basically a warp around. But this will get me the missile expansion that I was questioning. Okay. Cool beans. Now I've got purple and green. That means there's a door in here I can go through, right? I'm gonna keep an eye out because I feel like so far there's a trend of like, or a potential trend of one energy tank and one missile tank in every area. Maybe? I don't know. This is a really big area. I'm not sure what to make of it. I 
don't think I have red, no, do I? Yeah, okay, so I can't do anything here. I don't have a precision weapon yet. Going all the way up there didn't get me anything. Aha! See, I was just saying, like, I had a feeling that there was gonna be an energy tank somewhere in this, like, maze. It, it j I just had the feeling. Okay, let's go back to that other area that I kind of skipped out on over here, yeah. So I was like, this- oh, no, never mind, this is not the way to go, I don't have red. Is there anything else I can do in this place, then? That was where I was expecting to need to go. And I obviously can't do that just yet. Aha, I can get out. Gotta do a bomb jump. Alright, so that's what we're supposed to do here. Okay, just a weird red light. I'm just like, what the heck is that? Artifact discovered! I really don't know what those are all about. further in here. So, is this just backtrack territory now? That's the feeling I get. can't go that way, but it's a red door anyway, and I don't have precision. You know, that's been the consistent problem with all of this. So, uh... I guess that's that. Probably why they give you a teleport pod, but I was like, oh, I want to keep exploring. Like, I teleport back to the ship. Well, I'm, honestly, I gotta say, this is like basically what Metroid Prime 3 was trying to be, but like, it feels way more engaging because it's already like, asking more out of me in terms of like, it feels linear still, don't get me wrong, but like, linear in a way that's a lot more like, mentally like, in line with a Metroid game to me. Like, where it's like, emphasis on like, exploring, remembering, and going to other areas, like, when you get equipment to go to other areas, like, I don't know, this feels... Honestly, I'm kind of almost impressed so far with, like, where it's gone. I, I wasn't expecting it to feel like this, and yet here we are. Okay.
So... I guess we go to another area, because I don't know what else I can do there. I, I need precision to progress through there. I need red. First thing that jumps out to me are the green doors here. So I'm gonna go back here. <laughs> 